What's going on everybody? We're over here at the storage unit. This is where I got my plow set up. There's Coves. We got the salter right here. About to put the salter and the plow on. Make sure everything's working good. Uh, didn't get the footage yet, but we emptied out the truck. This thing was charging. This thing, the camera dies like crazy. You gotta keep charging it up. But uh, we got the bed of the truck all emptied out. We got the tailgate, the uh, tailgate off. Had to unplug the camera. Now we got the salter over here. The salter's got a bunch of uh, salt in it though. From last year, so it's gonna be a little bit heavy. Got a bunch of bags of salt in there. We're just gonna uh, load it up with the salt in it because we some beasts, hopefully anyway. And then we got the Boss V plow right here. We'll have to pull into it. Got a bunch of little miscellaneous stuff over here. But pretty much all the stuff is at my house, but I just kept the plow over here after I moved everything that way. I didn't have to have the plow out sitting outside over at my house. So. All right, well, we're gonna try to load this sucker up now. I'm gonna try to set this up for you so we can get it, so you get the right angle. It's a good spot for it right here. Let's see if we can hoss this sucker. Hossing it. Go, boy. I hope that camera stays. We got it in. You want to throw salt back back? Took a little bit of effort, but we got this sucker in. Uh, not right now. I guess you could. All right, she's on now. We're gonna have to get the plow hooked up now. We got the salter in. I have to pull in and get the plow hooked up. Boss V plow, about to get put it on. Got Chris pulling up here, risking it. See if he can get this tight squeeze in. See how long it actually takes him to get in here. He's about to smack that mirror. Oh, so close. Look at him. He has to attach him between these two things right here, so I'm going to tell him to come over here between these two things. Do the old reverse your version. Trying to get it straight. How about five years later? Motherfucker, don't know how to drive. I've already been through here, get this thing attached and gone. I've already been out this bit. I told y'all it's gonna take a while. This man don't know how to drive. Rookie in the making over here. Taking a ride this time. Come on, come on straight. Come on. How far you need to go up? 
All right, keep going. I told y'all it would take them two tries, max. Yeah, it's hard because there's not really much room back here. Not really much room between the storage units. So I scraped it a little bit. All right, so this right here, we got the connectors. I pull these connectors out. Connect this one, we got a little diode grease in there. Connect this to this. Uh, oh shit. Damn, I forgot. I didn't bring the controller. Fuck. Uh, I need the controller to lift this thing up. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, God it's, uh, damn it. I'm gonna have to go back to the house to get the controller to lift it up. I think. And let's see. Right, where's the other one here? It's always something here at Lavish, isn't it? Yeah, it's hard to remember everything. Right, everything's man. hooked up. Only one man over here. Up, but the controller's not left in, so. Call up Lauren. Like, yo, Lauren, bring this controller. Looks like we gotta go back and get the controller, guys. Chris made a rookie mistake and forgot it once gotta again. Up the season, I was thinking it was still in the truck. It's in the toolbox at the house. So I'm about to try this again. Come back here in a minute. We'll be back with another video, guys. Hopefully this time we can get everything right, everything tight, and get out of here. Made it back to the storage unit. Got the controller. This is what we needed right here. Connects down here little connection down here a little controller plow's not gonna work without the controller had it in my um, tool one of my toolboxes put it away for the season so definitely needed that so there's a Kobe over there waiting on me oh you can't see him because of the light but we'll try this again yeah back at it again with Chris here we had to go get the controller to lift this plow up but now we're back we got Chris over here trying to get in. Huh? No, nah, it's the garage door thing coming down. Yeah. Straight, straight. A little bit to the right, just a little bit. Yep, straight. Right, a little bit. Yep, a little bit more. Yep, straight, straight. Good. First time, baby! How we doing? I thought we were scraping on the side over there. Nah, there's that door back there. Straight to my roof. I already got enough scratches on this mug. Alright, let's see if we're back in business now. Let's see if this controller works. Alright, we're all the way in. Looks like about even on both sides. Gotta get this controller out. It's right here. Little connector pieces connecting to here. Like so. Gotta line up the little nodes. Oh yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna do a light over here. Oh yeah, that light fell off when we had that ice storm last year. And there was a bunch of ice. We were hitting ice, and it kept vibrating the thing, and it just snapped right off. Luckily, I found it. I gotta redo the bracket. I right, were plugged in. You gotta make sure that these are on the unlock. There's an unlock. There's lock and unlock. So yeah, I think you actually do want to lock it. It's been a minute since I did. So you hit the lock, flip it over to lock, flip it over to lock, and then you gotta put the controller in float mode. Let me see, I'll show them in float mode. You gotta put it in float mode whenever you're hooking it up. So you take the controller right here. And you just press this and hold the up button. Oh, you gotta turn it on first. All right, you hold down. All right, hold 
Hold that. Oh, you hold the down button. Hold the down button and then it turns red. Sorry, it's been a minute since I've done that. So hold the down button and it turns red. And then you come up here. There's a little switch on the side. This little switch on the side, you just hold it up. Pull it straight up. Locked and loaded, baby. We in business now, boys. All right, let's see. I'm going to lift it up a little bit and I'm going to pull out. Pulling out. Let's see it. All ready to go now, boy. Hydraulics went out. I had to replace the hydraulics. So I'm glad it looks like we're back in business. I just got to do the hydraulic change, oil change, and we're good. All right, we finally got the plow on. Got the salter back to the house. We're helping old Stromboli over here. Helping him out. He's moving. He got a nice little shop over here. Got a little office. Got the boat. He has a little trailer hooked up. There's a little heater out here. And up here on the top of the little office. I don't know what he's doing. The ladder's moved around. Damn, you got some firewood up in here or what? Yeah. That's been the end of the season for this year. He's going to leave it in over the season. He's done with the landscape. He's doing Christmas lights solo. Solely. With that big old 40 foot ladder right there. Strap that to the Magnum. Be ready to go. Let's pump. Let's make America great again. Let's go. We got the. He had to move. He's moving some of his stuff out of here until he gets his place all settled in. We got a little. We're doing it in the dark. Burning the midnight oil. Where them lights at, Strong? Huh? Where my warm lights at? Warm white. Warm white. Here's plenty of lights. You got the storage, man. You got lights for days. <laughs> I like it. Yeah, and bright ten thousand and lights right there. Yeah. Oh, he's got all the little ones too. A little bit of everything. You got some more wire in here. Got a little lamp. Yeah. And yeah. we got the setup. I need to get on his level. One of these days. One of these days I'll get like him. Oh, we gotta get to unloading some stuff. All right, we got load number two moving in the dark. Some lawn furniture, a little kayak. What else we got in here? It's load trip number two. Whoa. A mower in there. Yeah. Everything up top. There he goes. Nice little storage area. Hand it on up to him. Mark, where you at? I thought you was going to help. Where you at, Marky? Bastard. Not helping us out again. Scheme. <laughs> 